Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Did you miss me? If you're new to my channel, I'm Mariah. And if you're not subscribed, I'd love you to go down below and hit the subscribe button and turn on your notifications so that you don't miss any posting new video. But in today's video, I'm going to be doing kind of like a review slash demo of the Jesse Creels products because, hold on one second. Ugh. They sent a lot of products. Jessica's was kind enough to give you guys a coupon code to get 20% off on all of their products. So the code is KURLS18 and you just put it in at checkout to get 20% off. So in the package they gave me one of these and this is like a little pamphlet with all of their products and what you can use them for which is really helpful so that I can figure out like what products could work in my hair. So I started off my wash day using the Gentle Lather Shampoo. I liked this shampoo. I, I really like shampoos that lather because it just makes me feel like if my hair is getting cleaned. Um, this didn't strip my hair with moisture. However, it wasn't really moisturizing but it's a shampoo. I don't really expect it to be extremely moisturizing. It's not a conditioner. But as a conditioner, I use both the deep conditioning treatment as well as the Touche extra moisturizing conditioner. I used this one to condition my hair right after putting on the shampoo and then I added some of the Touche for slip when it came to detangling my hair. I really 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 love these two products. I use a tangle team tangle teaser sorry and it just helps my hair like detangle so quickly. I just like it. I think that these are actually like my favorite products from the whole Jessica's um, line just because it was so so good when it comes to detangling my hair. Okay so now when it comes to styling my hair they have a couple products well so I had to figure out like which products I wanted to use in my hair. Now they didn't have anything that was specifically a leave-in conditioner, which is kind of weird to me because I need some I need something that's gonna moisturize my hair. So I ended up using the same to share extra moisturizing conditioner as a leave-in. It does say that it can be used as a leave-in, but I just expected it to have a product that is specifically for moisturizing your hair. So this was thick on its own so I applied this onto my hair it was nice I liked it it was moisturizing however I had to choose between the Confident Coils Styling Solution and the Rocking Ringlets Styling Potion now although my hair is thick I have low porosity hair so I can't add too many thick products on top of each other because it's just gonna weigh my hair down so the Styling Solution the Confident Coils Styling Solution was like thinner so I chose to go this route however I didn't really like this product for wash and go I think that it could be a really good product for like roller sets and flexi wet and stuff because it's so thin but for wash and go I don't know I didn't really understand how to use the product so it's just like it just it was just another product but it didn't really do anything then, after that, I went in with the Spiralicious Styling Gel. So, this gel, like, it wasn't extremely thick, but it was thick enough to, like, clump my curls together. I liked that. However, I felt like I applied too much and I was overcompensating for the fact that the styling solution was so thin. Because I think I applied too much. It didn't leave my hair extremely crunchy. Like you could see my hair is moving or whatever. But there are some parts that were a little bit stiffer than the rest. But it's a gel so I expect that. I didn't get any flaking which is, which is great. Because that's like one thing that I hate. Like when you put gel in your hair and it starts flaking up. Like that is not cool. Um... I also think that this would be really good for like roller sets, 
flexi rods, perm rods and stuff because it's lightweight. Did it say that? Did it say that it's supposed to be lightweight? I don't know. But it wasn't like anything that weighed my hair down. And these were the results. I let my hair air dry as I usually do. And these are the results. This is second day hair by the way. You know, like first day hair that really looks like it smells. But this is second day hair. So I really hope you guys enjoyed my little review and demo. Obviously I couldn't use all of the products at the same time because it's just going to be too many products trying to do the same thing and I wouldn't be able to give you guys like a really good review. But when I try the products, I'll try to do like a little update on if I like the products on my Instagram because it's a lot easier for me to do it there. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, you definitely should. Also, I have a coupon code for you guys who actually want to try out the products. And Blessed with Curls is also doing a Jessie Curl giveaway. So you just need to find this um, picture on their Instagram page and just follow the instructions to be entered. It closes in one week. And the coupon code is actually Curls with a K. 18 and you get 20% off. I'll leave all of that information in the description box down below. So that's basically the end. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a like, leave me comments and give me suggestions as to what you guys would like to see for upcoming videos. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. Also, follow me on all of my social media platforms. Come on, y'all need to keep updated with me. You know, like I'm really active on Instagram and on Twitter. Snapchat, not really that much, but you know, y'all can still follow me. I do post on it, and yeah, that's all for now. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.